Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about how to find and obtain a list of users who have never logged in at least once in Active Directory. This can be really useful for managing user accounts and ensuring your Active Directory is up to date. To accomplish this, we'll be using Active Directory PowerShell commandlet called get hyphen ad user. This commandlet allows us to query users in Active Directory and check the value of the AD attribute last logon timestamp to determine if it is empty. By doing so, we can easily identify all enabled users who have never logged on. So let me jump into the PowerShell commandlet. So I'm going to use this commandlet, get hyphen AD user, and the filter, like I said, I'll be querying last logon timestamp to see if it is empty and I'll be querying only the enabled users and I'm going to get the name and distinguished name. So I'm going to press enter. So this will list all the enabled users who have never logged on. It's a great way to identify accounts that may no longer be in use. So you can see in my example, test user five has never logged into Active Directory. But what if you want to export this list to a CSV file? Well, you can do that as well. So I'm going to type the same command and I'll pipe it. I will use export CSV and I'm going to save it in C drive and I'm going to name this file as never logged on users.csv minus no type information minus encoding is UTF-8. So this command will export the list of users who have never logged on onto a CSV file named never logged on users.csv. You can specify the file path and the name according to your preference. So I'm going to press enter and I will go into C drive and you can see the CSV file here. So it lists the users who have never logged on. Having this list in a CSV format can be handy for further analysis or reporting. Now let's take it a step further. What if you want to find users who were created within a certain number of days, but have not logged in? So here's how you can do it. So I'm going to specify a variable called days and I'll give the value 30. And I'm going to specify another variable called created time. And I'll use this syntax, which will basically consider the day, which was 30 days before from now. I'll press enter. I'm going to use the same command, but this time I'm going to specify another condition which says when created is greater than the value of the variable created time, which is 30 days before from now. All right, if I press enter. So this will list all the users who were created within the last 30 days, but have not logged in. It's a handy way to identify any new user accounts that haven't been used yet. And that's it for today's video. I hope you find this information helpful. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more helpful tutorials like this. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.